I hate to Facebook and Instagram, so we'll do it. What's up? Peace. This is how I plan to retain being able to open and close my bucket on my Alice Chalmers tractor 170 1970 and be able to angle my snowplow this winter. I had to buy some of the plumbing pieces and the three couplers. This one I already had, found it on the shelf. I already had the valve body. So I only had to buy some hydraulic parts and some plumbing pieces. Um, so I'm just not sure which which side, which direction I need to put the valve in to control which side. Like I don't know if out controls this side or this side or in. Like I don't know which direction the valve has to be to control the left or the right side. All I gotta do is get some short hoses made, maybe two or three feet. I'd say two. Thread them into here, then put the male hydraulic ends on there. Those will plug in the remotes from the tractor, and then the plow remotes can go, the plow hoses can go here, and the bucket hoses here, or bucket hoses here, plow hoses there. It depends which way the valve is to control what side controls which implement, the bucket or the plow. But I got everything tightened up. Like I said, all I need is the hoses now to be made. They're going to be short. I would say no longer than two feet. At least I'm hoping. Anyways, that's what I've been working on and I'm I've been batting this idea around for a while and I finally said, yeah, I'm going to do it. So it's pretty near done and then it won't be long to be able to try it. We'll get it to her out later. Peace. Have a good one.